Hi, this is Josh Boulevant with Trapper's Landing Lodge. It's November 8th and I'm out in a hooded sweatshirt. So got some beautiful weather in the area. It looked like we were gonna be on pace to have an early ice season, just like what we kind of had last year or previous years. But just like every, everyone else, Minnesota throws a curveball, and we've got some above temperatures coming our way. So uh, with that being said, Water temps, if you guys are wandering across the lake, I was just out the other day, I saw anywhere between 36 and 40 degrees, depended on where you were at. Obviously there were some harbors and some shallower bays that were starting to get some skim ice, so obviously they were probably a little bit cooler while we were out there, but right now with the warmer temp, the rain the last couple of days, everything's wide open on the lake. Now with that being said, I still have seen some walleye and muskie anglers out on the lake, so those walleyes are still hanging out in the same spots, those weeds, Weed, sand, big flats out here, jig and a minnow. Make sure you got your forward facing sonar. Find those schools, pitch that jig and a minnow to them. You'll still have plenty of walleyes right now, especially if you haven't put the boats away yet. Uh, the musky anglers that have been out there, they've either been doing that classic uh, big bobber, trolling the bobbers with the big sucker, uh, throwing big rubbers uh, for those muskies right now. The tulipy and whitefish pond has started on the rocks. Yeah, we have seen that while we've been out in the early mornings duck hunting out on the lake, but you guys will still see that going on right now. It looks like next week's gonna be some beautiful weather to pull out that boat again. So if you haven't put it away yet, come up here, explore some, get some last minute open water, uh, fishing for those muskies or walleyes. It's going to be, looks like it's gonna be a shaping up to be a really good uh, next week for that. So especially how, or come up on Thanksgiving, spend Thanksgiving, go out in the boat, go check out the great deals going on at Reed's for that Black Friday sale too. So it looks like we'll still have open water for that. Uh, for guys looking for ice, uh, we're still crossing our fingers. We're still gonna be open up that December 26th, hopefully. Uh, we'll know as we get closer, obviously, we're gonna have to see how the weather plays out, how Leech Lake plays out, everything in the area. So a lot of that, so just stay informed with us. If you're still looking for some great lodging options and still haven't planned your ice fishing trip yet, our, we got a great special for you guys right now. So you get a three bedroom timber lane cabin, one of our 10 by 22 sleeper houses, and that's gonna be $500 per night. That's not a per guy rate. That's a flat rate. You can have up to six guys inside that. Uh, perfect for that size group out in the ice house. Plus you get all your gear provided with that. So that's $500 per night. If you did our three bedroom lake home with that same ice house, it's gonna be $600 per night. And then if you really want the luxury, our brand new three bedroom beach homes uh, with the ice house, $700 per night. So that is a call in only special right now. So 218-836-2500. Make sure you reserve your spot, get out on the ice. If you're having problems looking online, uh, we are very um, busy with our ice house rentals right now. So please give us a call. We'd be happy to help you out, get you booked for the ice season. So we're all looking forward to that here. Uh, we are on the ice countdown. We still got a couple weeks of duck hunting up here. We still got the deer hunting seasons. And if you still haven't put your boat away, how many times can you say you've ice or uh, we're out in your boat, open water fishing for walleyes on Leech Lake over Thanksgiving. So from all of us here at Trapper's Landing Lodge, we hope to see you guys on the water. We're also crossing our fingers. We get to see everybody on the ice. So uh, again, from all of us, hope to see you guys next week.